Hello all. Welcome to the Weefster 18. Monday, February 10th, 2020. It's day 14. I'm glad to be back, guys. I took a week off. Um, I actually turned the big 5-0 on last Tuesday. I am now 50 years young. I feel strong. I feel really strong, guys. It's just a number. Um, but strong, strong. Strong is a word. It's possessing skills and qualities that create a likelihood of success. My wife, Mama Weave, she has a lot of inspirational signs around the house. Okay. Positive signs. This one, for instance. Again, putting on my specs. Specs. You never know how strong you are until being strong is the only choice you have. Right? Deep. Deep. When I'm talking about strong, I'm not we're not talking about this. The muscles, the strength. That's the easy part to get strong. I'm talking about the mental part of strength, surviving, getting through life day by day. Back back about 10 years 10 years ago, we had a house here in Greenwich, my wife and I, three little boys at the time, young. We were struggling. We were struggling hard to pay our bills, put food on the table for our kids. I was working hard. We lost our home. We, we went foreclosure in our home. We went bankrupt. We lost our vehicle, transportation. But we kept our strength. We kept strong through this time. My wife and I, young boys, we kept together as a family, building strength. I look back, they gave us $5,000 to, to leave the home. The bank took our house. They gave us 5000 to start our life. That's all we had. But I knew I had to be strong for my family. Picked up our things and we moved on in life. We got ahead. We didn't give up. Fast forward eight eight more years. Boys are getting bigger. Bam, we get hit now. We get hit with a horrible thing. My youngest son is diagnosed with brain cancer. He's going to die. What do I do? I keep strong for my family positive for my family seeing him fight every day of his life getting up doing the pictures for this channel wanting to help keeping strong to fight gave me the inspiration to keep strong how can I not I can't compare to him. You know, we have, we all have problems, guys. We all have problems. Addictions, drugs, alcohol, gambling problems, 
Whatever it is, someone's battling something in life. You need to be strong, guys. Stay in there. Fight it. Get support from others. Go to groups. Get the strength to rebuild your life. Everyone is worth something in this life. We are all worth something. Depression. If you're depressed, I, as I said in the first few videos, I am not a doctor, psychiatrist. You take my opinion as it is. But if you're depressed severely, there's no hope. You, you're thinking no hope. Please get someone. Find someone to talk to. And they will help you get your strength back, your positivity to keep going on in life. Life is good. Life is good. Guys, day 14. We're doing the pug, the pug drawing. So, We had, we had more than three. I'm gonna, if I get more than three drawings, I'm gonna just show three. So this way, everyone gets a chance. <coughs> excuse me to, uh, to be involved for second and third. If I get a lot more, I may have to do four or five a day, or a viewing. These are cool. These are cool drawings. They're <laughs> two to three are very colorful. I mentioned color. Um, I love them. A little cartoonish, which is fine. I mentioned that. If you want to throw a little cartoonish uh, look to it, that's fine. And these are big support. These are the guys that sent it the last time. And I appreciate this, guys. I really appreciate all your support. Uh, I think it was one of these guys that sent this in. He sent me an email. Hey, Papa Weave, where are you? We're worried about you. I'm doing great. Just took a week off. Uh, third place. Color. Woo. Wow. I love it. I love it. Kind of a cool dude, Pug. Right? <laughs> cool. Third place, we got Ian Carter. I like it, Ian. I like it, man. Second place. Now, in second place, not much color at all, but the detail. See, I, I love detail, as you guys know. I love the detail. I think if you added some color to this one, it would have been first. Um, but I like the detail. I like how he shows the whole body, the, the actual paws and everything. Uh, second place, we have ink pen. Great drawing, man. Great drawing. First place, day 14 for the pug drawing. This drawing is kind of a cartoonish drawing. It's calling the old pug pugly. I like that. The eyes are nice. It looks like the uh, the white in the eyes, the, the light and eye, little, little hearts it looks like. That's pretty cool. He's got a tooth hanging out. Got a suit on. It's it's great. First place, day fourteen for the pug drawing. Michael Vogel. Ah, Michael character man the character got me i love it i love it hey guys listen papa weeb drew one 
I did I did a little more realistic maybe not not so cartoonish uh, and and this was Stevens this was Stevens best uh, or favorite favorite uh, pet if he could have one like I said we can't we couldn't have one with the with the landlord doesn't allow it in the household um, so here's my drawing I don't think it's too bad guys check it out. I added a little color on the dog, brown, the black nose, and a blue, just a shaded blue background. So listen, guys, great drawing. Send them in, please. Uh, we, we're not getting that many. Thursday, I'll, uh, I'm going to do another video, and uh, I have a couple to show, but uh, please send them in. You know, the description box, link to uh, my Instagram and my email. And if you guys ever want to email me, um, not regarding the drawings. If you just want to talk, say something, uh, I'm here for you. So send me some emails, guys. Um, stay strong, guys. Stay strong, positive. We, you're all worth something. You are all worth something. And if you stay strong, you listen to my videos, the, the past videos, the inspiring words. Keep those words in your heart, in your mind. Stay strong. And I, God, I pray you'll be a, a happier person. All right, guys. One day at a time, guys. Thumbs up. And I will see you on Thursday. Peace out, man.